So, yeah, Glock 45. Heard and uh, read some very interesting things about this uh, handgun. This thing is extremely light. Like, it has a polymer lower frame. The slide is made of metal or aluminum. The magazines are actually, the magazines are almost as heavy as this thing. And they're co completely compatible with Glock 17 and Glock 18 and uh, vice versa. So Glock 18 extended mags will fit in this thing, which is why I wanted, wanted this handgun. It's, it's like a really nice compact head handgun, just like the Glock 19. And uh, it takes Glock 17 and 18 mags, which is great. All right, let's take a look at some of the other stuff that I got. Put this away so it doesn't explode. No idea what this is. This is a mask. So I guess this is a gift. I don't think I'll be using these. Got these bad boys. These were quite expensive. They're also quite rare. These are almost impossible to find. At least for me. Got some mechanics, mechanics patches that probably won't be using another patch that'll be it for the Glock 45 I'll be playing with this thing definitely and uh, let's move on Damn, this is why is this so freaking hard? <sighs> this I think I give up. This is like impossibly hard. <sighs> now I can't remove it. Holy shit. I like it.
Wait a minute, did I, did I not get iron sights? What's this? These are unlock rails. That's a speed loader and not much else. Actually, I won't be needing the iron sights. You'll see in a second. I needed one desperately. Cantilever mount, it's a little bit pricey, but it'll be worth it. This is anyway that's the cantilever mount. And it's a really nice one. QD. QD locks. And I can quickly take it off any gun and put it on another. So airsoft zone, they're apparently either in Germany or in Austria. And I was surprised how much stock they have. They have some really amazing stock, like like they have like re, like they have op optics for real steel stuff. Like they've got Vortex, they've got Holosun, they've got like those those optics that the military uses oh, nice I even get a battery that's sick nice you don't get a battery that is sweet Vortex Crossfire 2. 1 4 times 24. I wonder if I can look through it even though I don't have a battery inside. I can. Doesn't even matter if I don't have a battery. Can I zoom in? It requires a little bit of force. Yup, I can zoom in without a battery. I don't need anything. It is quite nice. Alright, let's mount this thing onto the cantilever mount and put it on my BCM. I got it. It's not like perfectly aligned. I'm gonna have to work on that later. Ooh, man. Now that is sick.
not bad. It doesn't shoot very fast, but it kicks very nicely. This thing, I think it's set up for heavier BBs. I got some point threes, so I may not be very accurate. Long gas. All right, let's see what the rest of these items are. So that's a, a cylinder head for a version seven gearbox the gun I'm working on. So it's nothing too interesting, but let's open it up. Just an aluminum cylinder head. And these. Sledgehammer. What could this possibly be? I don't know. Hmm. It's definitely interesting, at least to me. I don't know. Stay tuned. And these are hop of buckings, I believe. Yep, Maple Leaf MR Hop. This is a 60, I think. It's supposed to be like, like, like you put it in a, like, it's like a drop in uh, MR, it's like a drop in uh, R Hop. So we'll see how that works. These are tensioners. It's like a flat hop tensioner. That's going in my M416, and that's going in another gun. So that's the end of that unboxing. I don't know if you've made it this far without skipping through, but if you did, I, I don't know what to say. You might be an ultra fan, which I find kind of weird because my very videos are not, are not very good. I just started anyways. So yeah, 2100 euros almost when you're when you're buying gbbs it's pretty it's pretty easy to, to spend that much i mean just just these freaking magazines are worth 80 80 euros each um the rifle and the cantilever and the optic just these three are worth 1300 euros so I ordered from three different stores in this unboxing. So this Glock 45, the magazine, these MP7 magazines, and the gases came from a local store. This BCM, and uh, I think this magazine and this uh, Wii Mauser came from Gunfire. They're my favorite store right now. They have really good prices. I, I also have some... Uh, some discount codes, which I use pretty much every time. Uh, so if I didn't have these codes, these rifles, all these, all these things would have been even more expensive. So yeah, that's insane. And the cantilever mount and the optic came from airsoftzone.com. Pretty sure they're in Germany. They have some really amazing stock. Like they have. Maybe I'm gonna exaggerate a little bit. They have hundreds of brands and you can get like Vortex, Holosun, um, EOTech, Aimpoint. And they have tons of other brands. They don't have like literally everything. They don't have GHK. They don't have uh, like their GVBR selection is kind of weak, but they have pretty much everything else. Also, Airsoft Zone has some really fast shipping, just like Gunfire. My, uh, my stuff came in like three days. I'll be exploring more Airsoft stores in the future, so I think that'll be pretty interesting. 
especially for beginners who uh, who might want a little bit more options when it comes to airsoft guns and buying airsoft guns. Like always, thank you for watching. I'll definitely have gameplay with the BCM. I'm gonna have plenty of gameplay. I want to get my money's worth out of this gun. I'm gonna be playing with the Glock 45. Need to find some uh, some smaller field to play this on. And definitely be playing with the Mauser. Like I said, gotta get my money's worth out of these guns. Take care, guys.